monster in for the elk is grown. As you can see, we're still in the backyard, and that's because we're continuing planting all the stuff that's on the patio. We had a lot of stuff that needed to be planted. But in this video, we are going to plant something that just came in about four days ago that I had canceled the order on, and that is an urban apple, more specifically a golden urban apple. They are grown and designed to be grown in containers so you can tuck it away on your patio or on the side of your garden. They go about eight foot tall, eight to 10 foot tall, but they're only two foot wide. So they're a long, you know, tubular type of tree that grows apples. It takes about one to two years before they actually start to produce, but you also need a second one if you're going to have it for pollination. I've only got one. Like I said, I canceled this order and it came in and I ordered it back the end of December and I just got it four days ago and I actually canceled it back in March. But I guess because maybe I was so upset with gurneys because uh, a blueberry that they had sent me was dead upon arrival. It was already dead. And then a lot of the seeds that I bought from them, none of them germinated. I mean, I had zero germination on all of them. It is what it is. We're gonna plant it up in a container and We'll put it up there with the rest of the apple trees, I guess. So if you all are new here, welcome. And if you are returning, I'm so glad to see you again. Let's get growing, y'all. Okay, so first let's talk about the tree. It's right here. When it came in, the box was crushed yeah crushed if you follow me on TikTok, uh you know what even if you don't follow me on TikTok, i'll put it i'll put a link to the video down in the description where i show the box how it's crushed this is the tree in its entirety it came in well obviously they took the soil off of it so people would call this a bare root i call this a tree that got the soil taken off of it and you can see they clipped the branches but luckily i've had it soak in for about i don't know it's been good 72 hours because honestly this tree was as dry as a bone when it came in but watering it that long has caused it to start you know to kind of grow branches so we're going to plant it in a 20 gallon container it's the red one right boop, boop, right there and i've already put a little bit of soil in it and i've put some of true's uh bone mill in it right there if you don't know, anytime you plant a fruit tree, any tree for that matter, you should always, well, and a fruit tree, but you should always put bone meal in it. You don't have to necessarily put fertilizer in it. Some people, like I said, would call this a bare root tree. This is not a bare, this is not what I consider a bare root tree. It's bare root because someone took the soil off of it, but I promise you right here is dirt. So that tells me someone unplanted it, stuck it in some water, rinsed it off. So therefore, not a bare root and it's not dormant because it's growing so we're going to plant it in this pot um, and we're also going to give it some of the citrus fruit uh, grow well or proven organic citrus and fruit tree slow release fertilizer it's a 10 to 8 for those of you who want to know so you know sometimes Maybe it's the pandemic. I don't know, guys. But sometimes I wonder why some of these nurseries do the things they do. So, we're going to put it in here. Forgot some of this fertilizer in here. Slow release. Put a little bit in there. Let's try opening the bag. Put a little bit in there. There we go. Just a little bit. I'm gonna scoot it closer. Maybe you can see it better. You see that better? Okay. I'm gonna stir it around in there. Honestly, I'm just gonna do this. Okay, now we're gonna finish. Now you all see this little knot right here? That is a graft. So we're not going to try, well, luckily our soil isn't going to be that high. But if this was deeper in there, you would not want to put your soil any higher than that.
right, I'm gonna stake this. So here's the stake that I'm using. It's about a five foot stake. So we're gonna put it just at the back here. See it, okay, so we're gonna stake. Here's the stake, it's about a five foot stake. We're gonna put it just behind the tree. Push it all the way to the bottom. We got some natural twine. Nothing crazy. We're gonna grab it right in the middle. Right there. And stake it in. This will help the roots as they take shape to keep the tree straight going up and down. So there it is. Like I said, it's just blah, blah, it's strictly made for container gardening. So if you have a small space, it's a great apple. Um, they cost you anywhere from $49.99 to $69.99. And I also believe that Burpees carries them. I'm not sure about Stark Brothers, but this came from Gurney's. I do not recommend going and get anything from them. The, my last few orders, honestly, y'all have been not good. Um, like I said, that might be a pandemic thing. It might be it's sitting out in a in a ship dock somewhere waiting to come in thing. I, you know, honestly, I don't know. But I'll link my TikTok video where I show it and unbox it so you all can actually go and see what it looked like when it came in. And like I said, it was very dry and I soaked it for 72 hours in water just to see if I would see life and sure enough, I did. So there it is, the urban apple. Let me know down in the comments if you all have ever had any problems with a nursery and how they handled it. Like I said, uh, initially they just gave me my money back when I said, hey, it's not gonna be here on time. And that was fine. That was what I, that was the outcome I wanted. So to get it in the mail when it showed up and then for me to call them and say, hey, I didn't, I didn't want this. And they were like, well, it was our mistake for shipping it to you. Free of charge, free tree. I guess that's okay, but eventually, because it's going to take a second tree, I will have to get a second tree for it, and I had already canceled the two that I originally ordered. But with that said, if you found some value in this tiny little short video on how to grow or how to plant an apple tree into a container, let me know down in the comments. Give us a like and a thumbs up. It helps the channel to continue to grow. Also, share this video with your friends and family if you so desire. But don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification button because new videos are posted often. And I would hate for you to miss anything. Until I see you in the next video, you all keep growing, you take care of yourself, and keep your heads up.